It's Sterling with JDS Labs, and this is your guide to getting started with Atomamp. Step one, start by plugging in the supplied power adapter. Step two, you'll want to connect your source. For you, this may be your PC or laptop, a tablet or phone, or Atom DAC. Atom Amp accepts 3.5 millimeter TRS or RCA cables as inputs. Don't use any other types of cables. They won't work. In my case, I'm using my phone. I plugged one end of the cable into an adapter and I'll plug the other end into the amp. If you're using a DAC with RCA outputs, you can plug those into the inputs on the back. If you're using bookshelf speakers, you'll want to connect those to the RCA outputs. Step three, now I'll plug in my headphones. Make sure your headphone jack has a quarter inch connector. Adapters are often bundled with premium headphones, so you can look there first. Also pay close attention to the number of poles or rings on your headphone cable. Headsets or headphones with inline volume controls may have an extra pole requiring a TRRS adapter. A TRRS jack is identified by having four poles, right, left, microphone, and ground. If this is you, you can bypass the mic with a single adapter like this. Or, if you want to split the signal, you can use a splitter. This is useful if you're using Atom with a PS5 or another device that accepts a mic input independently. When I'm adjusting the gain or volume on the source, I'll set it at 100% and then use Atom Amp for my main volume control. As with any amplifier, use as little gain as possible to reach the desired listening levels for you. Switch to high gain only when you need more volume than low gain provides. If you're using the 3.5 millimeter and RCA inputs, you can switch between the two with the input button. For 3.5 millimeter, press the button. For RCA, unpress it. And that's it. If you have any additional questions or you'd like some help troubleshooting common issues, head over to our support section at jdslabs.com forward slash support. We have some great information there that's going to help you get the most out of your new Atom app.